Coming up on today's episode of Airborne Unlimited, UAvionics earns TSO for tail beacon, Brightling and sponsorship contract with Apache Aviation, and Textron celebrates the delivery of its 300th Cessna Citation CJ4. Welcome back to Airborne Unlimited. I hope you had a wonderful long weekend. I'm your host, Sophie Herlock. UAvionics has received FAA TSO approval for its tail beacon integrated rear position light ADS-B out solution. Much like the popular sky beacon, the tail beacon has been optimized for ease of installation with times of less than an hour, including documentation. The tail beacon system consists of a total of four TSOs, ADS-B, GPS, barometric altitude sensor, and position light. In preparation for approval, UABionic tooled a second manufacturing line and obtained FAA Manufacturing Inspection District Office approval. UABionics has already initiated the Supplemental Type Certificates program with the FAA and is ready to perform the required STC flight testing and deliver products shortly thereafter. UAvionics will be on display at EAA AirVenture from July 22nd to the 28th in booth number 3081 and 3082. We'll be right back with Around the Patch. Today is a new dawn. With a new name. Un nuevo logotipo. A new factor. Un einen globalen Kundenfokus. We are Continental Aerospace Technologies, and we stand behind you. There's a difference between charting a steady course and pushing for the ceiling. And for nearly a century, Hartzell Propeller has been defining that difference. It's in our passion for engineering and research and our dedication to testing the limits of performance. We are built on honor. We are Hartzell Propeller. Now let's take a quick look at some interesting news coming out of the aviation industry. It's time for today's trip around the patch. UPS is bringing the Boeing 747 to EAA AirVenture Oshkosh to celebrate the airplane model's 50th year in flight. The year this revolutionary aircraft took to the sky also marked the same year the world's largest flying convention, EAA AirVenture, declared its permanent home in Oshkosh, Wisconsin. Over 10,000 aircraft and more than 600,000 people are expected to attend. Airbus Canada Limited Partnership marked its first anniversary on July 1, 2019. One year exactly after Airbus became the majority partner in the A220 aircraft program. Highlights of this first anniversary include orders and commitments signed for more than 230 A220 aircraft. The groundbreaking for a new A220 manufacturing facility in Mobile, Alabama and expansion at the Mirabel Manufacturing Facility. The FAA has issued a special airworthiness information bulletin concerning a potential issue that may cause certain versions of the Rockwell Collins ProLine Fusion Flight Management Systems to fly a wrong turn direction when deleting a waypoint. The FAA is requesting owners and operators to report any cases related to this issue directly to the FAA. SpaceX and Tesla founder Elon Musk may be turning his attention to an electric airplane, which he thinks could be attainable in just a few years. Musk has been a strong supporter of all electric modes of transportation and said several years ago he had an EVTOL aircraft on the drawing boards. However, the aircraft never made it past the design stage. Musk said at the time the energy density of batteries was not sufficient for such aircraft to be commercially viable. We'll be right back with the rest of the news after these messages. Concorde's recombinant gas RG series sealed battery technology produces a high performance battery with the advantages of being pre-tested and fully charged at the factory. 
Find out more about Concord's entire line of batteries at www.concordbattery.com. Concord, the heart of your aircraft. Build and fly with the most exciting line of kit aircraft on the market, the Sonics Aircraft B Models. The B Models offer more room and comfort, more fuel, more panel space, more engine choices, and the same great Sonics Aircraft flight characteristics. Learn more at sonicsaircraft.com. Apache Aviation announced at the end of the 2019 season, its 7L39 Albatross team will no longer fly under the Breitling colors and brand name. After 17 years, Breitling is deciding not to renew the sponsorship contract of the Breitling Jet team. For the 2020 season and beyond, Apache Aviation President Jacques Bothelin is setting up a sponsor research strategy using unique know-how developed over 37 years of aerial demonstration. The future of the team will hopefully be ensured either by an exclusive sponsor or a pool of co-sponsors. Breitling Jet Team was established in 2003 as the first professional civilian jet team in the world, flying in Europe Asia, the Middle East, and North America. Apache Aviation has operated an aerobatic team since 1982 under Martini, Echo, and Adeco, and Breitling Colors and has performed 3,000 safe displays in 39 countries. Textron celebrated the delivery of the 300th Cessna Citation CJ-4, which was delivered to McNeil Steel based in Dodge Center, Minnesota. McNeilis Steel is a family-owned metals distribution business founded back in 1948 and is now upgrading to full ownership of a CJ-4, having been a fractional owner of a Cessna Citation CJ-1 Plus since 2016. Introduced in 2010, the Cessna CJ-4 is the largest of the Cessna light jet family of aircraft that includes the Citation CJ-3 Plus and the Citation M2. The CJ-4 allows customers an IFR range of 1,926 nautical miles, with a maximum cruise speed of 451 knots. The CJ-4 is certified for single pilot operation, has seating for nine passengers, and includes a notable 1,040-pound baggage capability. Other features include single-point refueling, an extremely serviceable laboratory, and excellent range. And that's our show for today, everyone. If you're watching us on YouTube, please subscribe and check us out on Twitter and on Facebook. Head over to our website, aero-news.net, for comprehensive around-the-clock coverage of the latest aviation and aerospace news. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you right back here tomorrow for an episode of Airborne Unmanned.